A California-based EV manufacturer that hoped to make vehicles in the valley has filed for bankruptcy. Fisker had plans to make a small electric vehicle in Lordstown, but paused the plan because they were struggling financially to survive. Gina Cadigan has more on what the company is now doing to try and recoup its funds. An electric automotive manufacturing company, Fisker, has filed for Chapter 11 bankruptcy. The company says, like others in the industry, the state of the economy impacted its ability to operate and is looking to reorganize. The company early in the year had warned investors that it did not have enough cash to get through the year and they simply ran out of cash and this is pretty much the end of the company. Fisker considered Foxconn in Lordstown as a facility to produce its small electric vehicle called the Pair EV. Before a contract could be finalized, the plans were paused while Fisker dealt with financial troubles. Experts say they don't expect that to ever happen now. It takes a lot of money to launch a product. Fisker clearly doesn't have the money. The Lordstown Foxconn has been considered for several other manufacturing products over the years, including the Indy One prototype vehicle and the Lordstown endurance truck. Many ended up not being produced because they didn't reach a full contractual agreement. I think the fact that these contracts with Foxconn are falling through are really not Foxconn's fault. The problem that they've got is they've been working with companies that are not well capitalized. And when they run out of money, that's pretty much it. And I think it's better if Foxconn started to look at some of the more established companies. Currently, Foxconn in Lordstown is producing an electric Monarch tractor. A spokesperson for the facility said production is going well, but they would not disclose how many have been finished at the facility. With more local news, I'm Gina Cadigan.